Excuse me, is, uh... Whoa. Uh, hey, guys. Looks like we've all had the same idea. Are you here to speak with him as well? Uh, kinda. So, he's not here? Nope. He left around noon. Said he was meeting up with Akechi. Sojiro said if we need to talk about stuff, we can use this place for a while. Cool. You know... He asked me the other day... Something along the lines of whether or not I'm okay with how things are. At first I didn't know what he was talking about, but as he kept going... His words started making my chest feel all... tight. I know what you mean. And ever since then, it's like... Like something isn't right in my heart anymore. I have no complaints about my current life. On the contrary, in fact. I am truly happy with it. So, in that case... What is this inkling of a feeling I have deep in my soul? <sighs> ah, damn it. I'm so bad at figuring out this sort of stuff. Hey, do you think maybe we're all running away from something super important? Yes. I've been kind of wondering for a while now. Maybe the reason his words hurt so much is because he's right. But I was too scared to admit that for some reason. That's why I pretended I didn't understand what he meant. When I was speaking with him, I felt like I caught a glimpse of this mysterious sight. Something that shouldn't have happened. But still, I felt like I shouldn't turn away from it. Same here. And myself as well. It seems that we really have lost sight of something precious to us after all. That might be. But... But I'm so scared to remember what it is. If I remember that, I feel like my life as I know it is gonna end. Oh, Futaba. It's just like with, uh... I keep on trying to say Kasumi, but yeah, Sumi. But even still, I don't want to feel this way anymore either. Me too. Guess that's it, huh? He was trying to tell us all something important, and I bet he's probably still working on it somewhere. Ain't no way I'm going to bail on him just so I can keep running from whatever it is. When I had that strange experience you all mentioned, I saw him and the rest of us there together. I want to believe the connection we share here is a genuine one. Well, I know if we don't do something soon, we're gonna lose our connection with him. Don't ask how I know. It just feels like the truth to me. I admit I am happy right now, but I just can't accept the situation as it is. I'm done with trying to escape my problems. Oh? Huh? Oh, uh, there was no handsome man there. That was a cat. That was a feline. This palace still doesn't have a fucking name. But it does have a fucking beautiful, beautiful music to it. Well. The track is just... Mamma Mia, Chef's Kiss. Let's figure out where Maruki is first. I don't want to waste any time wandering about aimlessly. We encountered an information guide after going up that elevator. If he intends to welcome us in so graciously, perhaps we'll come across another guide soon. Before I forget, I suspect the battles are going to get even tougher from here on out due to our lack of manpower. If I must. Focusing on our own abilities is fine and all, but depending on the situation, it'll be more efficient to team up. The combination move we pulled off before, that wasn't half bad. All right. There we go. Of course, that all depends on whether or not you can keep up with me. Ha. Huh. You got me there, brother. Alrighty. I guess, uh... uh we cannot go to that uh, one spot we came to before, so I guess... We start from the beginning for the third time. Which I'm fine with, I guess. We didn't really get far last time. And I'm assuming we have a different place we need to go to. Maybe, I don't know. Well, let's see if anything's different here. Looks like there's not much different here, but it doesn't want us to go that far in either. According to our map. 
But let me steal all these treasures that I forgot to sell. Like, we were literally there, and we could have sold the shit that I've been collecting, but nope. I'm forgetful. I think it was somewhere around here. VIP patients identified. We will now begin the Grand Tour. The auditorium is now open. The master awaits you there with the patient you seek. Please enter through the door on the left-hand side of the entrance hall. Just as I thought, they're politely informing us of their location. And that's where we gotta go. That must be the door. Let's go. Sounds good to me. Oh, I'm getting worried, though. Oh, time to fight shadows in our current state as well. Your true form. I'm sure this can't go badly at all. I'm sure I'm not going to make terrible decisions. They didn't see us at all. I forgot. I can't use our navigator. So light fire the and fire. They're weak in general and even weaker to nuclear attacks. Jesus Do Christ. Let's go. Oh, I have an idea. I have a fantastic idea, kind of. Let's see if I can pull this off. Actually, you know what? I'm too lazy. Go down. Joker took one down. I gotta keep up. Hmm. Do it. All right. I really want to. I really, really would like to get the all-out attack with a catchy, but I don't think it's gonna happen here. Unfortunately. Yeah, I just needed to get a crit. How should we kill off the last one? Damn, resistant, huh? Uh oh. Oh, okay, I'm okay. Tight. Oh, I'm sure it does, brother. I'm sure it does. Damn, I'm already taking hits. Oh wait, this one wasn't weak to fire. My bad. Smirking. All right, let's finish this one up. A challenge. Fingers crossed that I can actually get the all-out attack with a catchy. I want to see his uh his okay. shit. Shadow eliminated. Now let's get our little treasures here, and let's see what's going on here. You know, this is great stuff. am I interfering in a lecture or some shit here? Not too big of a room, but I would like to say that this is the only one that we need to explore. Oh shit! I thought I got seen. I want to say that this is the only one we need to explore before we meet up with Dr. Maruki. Oh, perfect. Perfect. Oh, fuck. Alright. I think we'll get the all-out attack with Akechi here. Fingers crossed here. Let's see it. Yes, sir. Uh, it wasn't enough. Damn it. Oh, fuck. Oh, come on. Friend in danger, they live or die. I'm not giving you a chewing soul. I've got the Thieves Guild. Thank you, MSOS47. And the Los, whatever that was. Ha! Ah. I guess it would be good if I used a little bit of curse here. But I only have heavy curse to all foes. Yeah. See, it doesn't work with me, which kind of it, it kind of stinks, you know. And of course, they have fucking high counter. You'll pay for that. Oh. I mean, we could do this. Fuck it, I like this. <laughs> This is always beautiful to see. Now that slice and dice. God damn. All right. So I need to, uh, I need a Reza catchy here. Trust me, this is this is all part of the plan. I promise you. We'll use okay. a lot of these items that I have. They've got a death wish. That was our uh, secret way of healing him back the whole uh, or the full HP. Okay, let's see it. 
Let's see it, boys. God damn. Akechi, you're really something, man. That's all I gotta say. Okay. <sighs> they made it difficult. No, I made it difficult. <laughs> I told you, I'm pretty dumb. Well, just in case, since I have the items, I'm not really worried anymore. I'll heal myself up a little bit. And we'll take this chest here. With a black rock. Can't do much with that right now. Not that I ever really did. Is there another shadow in here somewhere? The cognitive effects are weak. Oh no, but there is a safe room. That kinda worries me, you know. I feel like we got something coming up here. Alrighty. Hey. And expect such hospitality in a palace of all places. They must seriously believe we can resolve our differences in a civil manner. That is quite absurd. What's going on in here? Can I... It appears to be some sort of authentication device. We'll need the proper ID to proceed any further. We're not headed that way anyway. Let's forget about it for now. For now. I mean, we have a whole palace to explore at some point. I feel like kind of, kind of similar, you know, to Kamoshida's palace in the very beginning. There's story elements to get through first. <sighs> There's no doubt that Maruki is up ahead. Make sure you're ready. As ready as I'm ever going to be, Akechi. Honestly. Which means I'm not really all that ready. <laughs> Thank you for coming. Oh no, thank you. She's only sleeping. I've never had any intention of hurting her. Once her inner turmoil begins to settle, I'll have her remember her life as she wishes to live it. The life that she wishes for, huh? Call it what you like. You're merely brainwashing people for your own satisfaction. I'm wholly aware that some will interpret my acts that way. But if that self-satisfaction leads to the happiness of thousands of others, don't you agree that outcome is for the best? If I understand correctly, you went and checked in on your friends this past week. That's what you wanted us to do, right? This reality is the one that they all wished for. Did any of them seem troubled by that fact? Ah, uh, you're still jumping the gun with this. I'm just trying my best so I don't get laughed off the team by you guys. This reality is the true reality. All you have to do is recognize it as such. Once you do, you'll be just as happy as they are. Didn't you see it yourselves? Your friends don't just want to live these lives. They want you to choose this reality for yourselves and live happily too. This reality. I was so sad when she transferred for her parents' job, but all's well that ends well. But thanks to my sensei's patronage, each day also brings me closer to painting such an impactful work. Please, I want you to understand. For their sake, as well as yours. I'm just so thrilled for him. It's like he's finally getting the recognition that he deserves. Really? Then back to LeBlanc, people. It's curry time. Oh, father, is that jealousy I'm detecting? My friends want to stay in this reality. That doesn't seem right. I got captured in Kamashita's palace, and that's when I met you guys. And then when we'd go to Mementos, I'd transform into a... But is that really true? Well, it's time. <sighs> if I accept Maruki's offer, my friends and I will be able to live happily in this reality he's created. Or so he says. If we stay in this world, we really could lead happy lives, free from pain and suffering. But our memories will be distorted to allow for the new circumstances. There's probably no way to avoid that. For the sake of Yoshizawa-san, and the rest of your friends, I ask you to give me your answer. Yeah, I'm not accepting this shit. Huh? Negotiations seem to have broken down. I see. It seems we still haven't reached an understanding. And we never will. 
No. You're not serious, right? Please. I'm begging you, Senpai. Please let me live as Kasumi. But why? This pain is too much. Why can't I just leave it behind me? Kasumi is gone forever. And, and it's all my... All Sumire's fault. I can't live that kind of life. Is she gonna... She, this dumb bitch. God damn it. Please. Don't try to stop me. If you do, then I'll... How stubborn. No matter what you say to her, I doubt she'll understand. I don't think we have a choice in the matter here. I could take care of it for you right now. But you'd prefer her to leave here alive, right? Oh, a little bit. Just hurry up and end this. Please, don't make me do this. I mean, we know her weakness. Uh oh. No. Ha! Idiot. I, I, I mean, what? Okay, so. If she uses light, that means that dark is her weakness, right? So all I need to do is just bring up this big ass boy. Actually, wait, what's his weakness? Okay, yeah, we're fine. Go uh, down! I guess she doesn't have a weakness. Never mind. I mean, I could literally just keep this persona up, and I think I'd be pretty okay. Oh man, this this sucks, dog. This this hurts. Cause I still like her character. I really, really do. Don't get me wrong here. She's just being really dumb. She's only using one attack. Doesn't that lower her health too? Oh wait a minute, this is different. I forget. Uh, do I have the? Uh, I have concentrate. I guess that could be helpful. All right. Yeah, yeah. Keep on using sword dance. I'm sure that'll. I'm sure that'll work. All right. What? What lovely giant ass fucking attack should I just hit her with? What do I even have? I guess I can do this. Severe nuke. Why not? You're mine. Oh god. Why are you doing this to me? Bro, you're the one who came down to attack us. Please, just leave me alone. Please don't do this to me. Wait, when did she have charge? Wait a minute, I don't like that. Oh, I mean she can waste it. Persona. I'll just uh Yeah, I'll hey. use big old frog hey. boy and I'll just guard. Come at me. Yeah, yeah, good one. <laughs> it's time. I'm smart, you isn't. See, this is why I control Go my ahead. teammates. No. Not gonna lie, the uh, the one on one that I did with Akechi was harder than this. I'm just saying. Persona. It really was. There. Please don't do this to me. This still does hurt though. It hurts me, like, emotionally. Don't do this to me. God damn, seriously, just one more attack. I mean, if I have to head in myself, I will. There we go. Why? I'm sorry, but you kind of brought that on yourself. You need to open your eyes. I know it isn't easy, but that's reality. <sighs> Looks like you lost. Why? Bye. What if we just killed her on accident? No. I can't. I can't go back to being Sumire. You saw it all for yourself, Senpai. It's my own fault that my sisters... Why don't you understand? Please. I beg you. Yoshizawa-san. <laughs> hmm. 
I have a bad feeling about this. I can give you strength, so you don't have to suffer. Doctor. Tell me, if you want your pain to end, and desire to live as Kasumi, I'll actualize it. Oh man. I guess Jamie was right about something. The tentacles aren't stopping. What the fuck? Sadly, she has lost sight of herself. She's in pain. Now, be her guide, and together, escape from the nightmare! No, I... I can't! It's fucking with her persona. I don't want to go back to my life in cinders ever again! What the hell? This so-called kindness of his disgusts me. Let's do this quick. I refuse to go back! I'm happy here. This is where I belong! <laughs> so we have to fight her persona directly? What the fuck is happening? I'll rescue you. The only way I know how. Aw, oh, man. It's gone totally berserk. We need to stop her persona. Good thing I wasted a bunch of my SP. What the fuck? It ate the smaller one? What a pain. We'll have to beat it before it heals itself again. Do we need to get rid of the smaller one before it does that? Time. Oh, what a pain in the ass. There. This'll be a fun fight. I'm sure it will. Fear my power. I mean, we can try uh, this, maybe? <laughs> Like we, like, we gotta kill it. Oh, fun. Great. There goes my debilitate. Go. Oh, shit. I forgot. She could use light. Well, this is looking great. Hey, at least we get, uh, Rivers in the Desert. The, uh, the one without the, the lyrics, which is always a fun one. Oh man, this is gonna suck ass. Ah oh, shit, what do I want to use here? Hmm. I'll just fuck me. Yeah, I'll restore him. Using it. At least by 200. Payback time. I'll break them. Okay. We can try curse. Nope, it blocks it. God damn it. That's not good. And there's another. Let's go. What? Okay, at least he avoided that one. Persona! Okay, I'm gonna need to, uh... Let's see, what do I need to do here? Decrease defense for all foes. Guess we can try that. We gotta do something. Persona. Hmm. I mean, we can try Riot Gun again. Fuck me, man. Or a severe almighty. We'll give that that one a try. I mean, doing damage to her is going to be completely pointless. At least we're avoiding some shit. God damn it. Well, this ain't looking too good. <laughs> this really isn't. Jesus. The the whole like team of two is not easy to deal with. I'm not done. The catchy skill set is very uh, limited. Well, I guess anybody's would be. Hmm. Got I can't really buff ourselves either. I can try riot gun again. <laughs> try to get a crit in. And of course, I missed one of them. And it keeps on doing that, so we're not getting anywhere. Well, that's great. And she's got some health. It's not a lot of health, but it is health. God damn it. 
Okay, I need I need to put defense on us or something, because at this rate we're just gonna get fucked every time. We need the buffs. Uh, if I have any. I can use Heat Riser. Removes all stat buffs for them. Works for me. Yeah, I'm sure it does. I'm sure it does, brother. I'll help you out momentarily. Just stay alive. Please. God damn it. Of course he can summon two at once. Damn it. There's no end to this. Just what the hell is this thing? I refuse to return. I will never go back to being such pathetic, soot-coated garbage! You can't tell? It's her refusal to accept the truth. I mean, you even said it yourself. You have to accept the truth. You're weak if you don't. We can't afford to waste time on this shit! Here it comes! I don't think so! Oh? Thank fuck Ryuji's here. Damn it, Skull. I told you not to rush in by yourself like that. Oh ho ho. At least it seemed to work out in our favor. Our apologies for making you wait so long. Oh, no worries. We just almost died. And Akechi's on Is fire. That... Akechi-kun and Dr. Maruki? Yoshi's always trapped by... Why is her persona doing this? What in the world is going on here? Yeah, they're a little out of the loop here. <sighs> so much of this shit makes no sense, but we'll cover it later. We've got to stop her first, right, Joker? All right, let's get in formation. Okay, but can we keep a catchy as navigator? I would, I would honestly prefer that. Okay, guys, leave the navigation to me. No, 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 no. G give it, give it back to a catchy. Why did they come here? I won't hold back. At least for full health. Never mind. You know, it was fun while it lasted. Okay. Now we can really act. Alright. I've been waiting for this moment. Alright, we'll use debilitate on the middle bitch. Good old Vault Guardian, it's <laughs> So so good we get this animation back. This has to be the, like the most used attack or or buff or whatever. Like singular skill. Let's get it. Oh nice, I shocked one. Perfect. Not perfect. Time to use debilitate again. Yeah, I I really gotta do something about that. Time to change personas, I guess. I can use debilitate myself if I really wanted to. I guess I will. We'll keep her stats down. Oh, perfect. Here we go. Nice. And we'll move it over to Ryuji. And we'll give him this. Eat this. Finally, we're getting somewhere. I didn't think it'd be possible. But here we go. Uh, wait. We don't have any debuffs. We're okay. Alright, well, let's get the damage in. Uh-oh. I think my stream is going down. Oh, wait. No, it's still good. It's just, uh, my chat is being really stupid. Oof. Scary. Alright, let's get our attacks up. Try to finish this up a little quicker. Well, they're back. That kind of sucks, though, because she's, she's just going to do that. But it wastes her, uh, her shit, so there is that. We'll use Debilitate there. Let's see. 
We can do... I well, can't do Curse. I mean, we can try the Colossal Damage. Uh, that, that did something. Oh. That's what it's weak to. And now we know. Alright, Ryuji. Time to hit hard. Beautiful. It looks like it's working. Just hang in there a little longer. I catch she's literally dying. Yeah, we'll hang in there. We'll be okay. I'm gonna be honest, I didn't think we'd ever hear this song again. I'm glad we are. It's all coming together now. There's the summon. So she's probably gonna get healed again. No? Interesting. Damn, Akechi, you dying. Alrighty. Let's see what we got going on here. Hmm, <laughs> What would work best here? Let's see. Next physical attack. Oh, you know what? That sounds pretty damn good for me. Get ourselves ready for some crazy shit. All right, Makoto, you know what to do. Aw, oh, man. Okay, well, I have a good idea. I have a fantastic idea, actually. I, myself, have a nuclear ability. Hopefully that doesn't waste my charge. I don't think it would. Okay. Ryuji, you know what to do. God's hand. Oh, fucking lovely, dog. Lovely. And there we go. I don't know what that means, but tight. And this proves that a team of four can be a little bit better than a team of two. Yoshizawa-san! You've all... I can't believe you've thrown away your happiness just to come here and... And how? It's impossible. You're... You're Dr. Maruki, right? Yeah, the real one. That's right. More importantly, why are... Dude, what the hell's Doc doing inside a palace? He's ruling this palace is what he's doing. What? Not only that, he's the one who's generated this whole distorted reality. Isn't that right, Maruki-san? All of this was done for your own joy. Our joy? That's right. I only wanted to grant your wishes. Each and every one. Wait, you what? What do you mean? We never wish for anything like that. Is that really true? Huh? No, never mind. So, you all intend to deny the reality I've created for you. If you want to fight me, then so be it. If you plan on changing my heart, that's fine too. But before that, I think there's still room for discussion here. No, I don't think there is. We've are like, us, the protagonist, has given you our answer multiple times now. Akechi, like, I think ten times now. Also, I believe taking care of Yoshizawa-san is more important than settling this issue right now. Planning to run again. We can get back to fighting if that's what you really want. But I think you're rather exhausted at the moment. <sighs> Yoshizawa-san! Alright, bye. There's still time. February 3rd. I'll hear your final decision on the 3rd. If your views can't align with mine by then, 
we'll have no other choice but a physical altercation. As much as I would loathe that, I still can't give up what I've started. What I swore I'd do. On the day I lost everything that mattered to me. I've lost his reading! I want to pursue him, but I doubt that's even possible right now. Let's get out of here. Yoshi's know, always got to rest anyway. And off we go back to the real world. Well, fake world. Whatever this is. I'm still just as shocked as I was when we first came here. The navigators return to our devices. A palace is visible in our own reality. Um, does this mean reality's broken right now or something? Something to do with Dr. Maruki, anyway. Hey, how much do you already know about this stuff? Uh, I should tell them what I know so far. Wait, where's Akechi? So, Dr. Maruki... He altered our reality... to make our dreams come true? This is all too much for me to handle at once. Apologies for the interruption. Mind if I interject? That's right! Akechi! There's no reason to be defensive. Had I wished to kill you all, I would have simply done so already. Yeah, he's, he's not our enemy. So you're not here to fight us? I've already put our feud behind me. Not only that. Since he and I both refuse to accept reality as Maruki sees fit to make it, we currently have the same goal. So what you're saying is you're using him. What about the rest of you? Considering how you were all living your ideal lives in that other reality, until you decided to come here, Maruki seems to be telling the truth about taking your happiness into consideration. While his heart is distorted, he is quite different from the adults whose hearts you've changed so far. Now that you know his intentions, I'm most interested in learning whether you still plan on fighting him or not. What do you mean? I'm up against someone with the power to distort reality as we know it. The more allies on my side, the better. If we all share the same goal, shouldn't we join forces and improve our odds? <sighs> I'll be going now. Be sure to consider my point. I don't care what you all think. Hey! Hey! But Akechi's on my team. Jeez. Yoshizawa, are you alright? I... Oh, yes. I'm sorry that I caused you all so much trouble. N no, no, you don't need to apologize. We should probably go our separate ways for now and discuss it at a better time. Yeah. Tomorrow we can... Oh, yeah. Third semester starting up tomorrow, right? Aw, oh, man. I guess we're going back to school, huh? We still don't have any idea what we want to do from here on out, though. We've got time. Maruki said he'll wait until February 3rd before... Let's really think it over before making our decision. So, what does that mean? Like, operation start or whatever? We have a countdown until the third. We in infiltrate the palace. What's going Hello. on? Welcome back. Huh? Didn't know you guys were out together. Wait, what's wrong, Futaba? <sighs> hey, Sojiro, is mom? Mom? You mean Wakaba? Well, what about her? Uh, nah, it's nothing. It's just I happen to remember something about her, that's all. I see. Okay, then. You know, I caught myself thinking about her earlier, too. <laughs> Odd coincidence, huh? <gasps> well, I'm gonna head home for the night. How about you, Futaba? Mm, I'm gonna stick around a bit longer. I see. Don't stay out too late, all right? The place is all yours. You've got school tomorrow, too, so get to bed at a reasonable time. Mom really is gone again. Sojiro sees it that way too now. 
Oh, oh yeah, I forgot to tell you what happened before we came to rescue you. We all ended up here at the same time after you left for Odaiba. Yeah, don't worry, I saw the cutscene. What was that? Well, I didn't Wait, see this part of the cutscene. You're... What the? I'm... Oh yeah, that's right. Why were you human, Mona? Yeah, you're supposed to be a cat! I am not a... Oh wait, yeah, I guess I am a cat. Yeah, finally, he admits it himself. How did we never realize? You know, we've got more important things to do than sit around here and figure out what happened to us. That's right! You said he was headed to Odaiba, correct? And with Akechi-kun? We need to find them! And then off they went. Once we got to Odaiba, we spotted the palace. You know how the rest goes. You were fighting this whole time, weren't you? While I was just bumming around town without a care. I'm sorry. Deep down, I always suspected something strange was happening. Something wrong. But being with my mom was so much fun, I just... I stopped trying to figure it out. Ah, but I've totally snapped out of it thanks to you. I'm all good now. Yep, no worries. I'm fine. What? Gonna be a rough night for a lot of people. School's tomorrow, right? You better not stay up late. You might end up oversleeping. We've all been through too much today. Let's try to get some sleep. And it's, it's kind of interesting. I kind of theorized that this was like a whole nother world, but <sighs> in reality, it's sure, you know, Maruki's influence and his, you know, fucking around, but it is just the regular world. It's it's our sense, our perspective of reality. Everybody's cognition kind of melding together, and I guess that's kind of what brought some people back to life. You got something to say? <laughs> you were quite the looker. What? Look who you're talking about. How could I be anything else? Sheesh. All this trouble with Yoshizawa and Maruki. You, we've got nothing but problems right now. Yep. For now, we should all meet up at the hideout. We gotta recap the situation and hold a strategy meeting. Got that right. I've been trying to wrap my head around all of this, and it's just not happening. I can't think straight at all. I can hardly blame you. I'm still so confused myself. Either way, I think we've all earned a bit of rest. Maybe a good night's sleep will help us cal all calm down. You're right. Certainly, the combat has us tired out as well. We could use all the time to decompress, or use some time to decompress. And on that note, good night. <sighs> well, we're gonna need some time to figure all this out. Either way, we can think about this tomorrow. For now, we should go to sleep. Alright, so we have 25 days until Maruki acts. 25 days until what I will believe to be the final boss fight, but who the hell knows? If it is Maruki, some other strange being acting in behind the scenes or something, I don't know. But we have three more, or or two more in-game months, excuse me. Just about two more in-game months until we've reached our uh, our time to, to depart on out of here and the game is wrapped up. The final act of the game, the final semester or trimester or whatever. So whatever happens here, who the hell knows? But um, yeah, we'll wrap it up here. What a what a weekend of being able to really play through this new this new content. It'll probably be another weekend before I can get back to it. Unfortunately, gotta try and follow my stream schedule, I guess, which uh, doesn't really exist anymore. But regardless, thank you all for watching these episodes. It has been wild ever since we started the new content, and I'm in love with it. Absolutely. I can't wait to experience even more of it, explore that palace. It's going to be a bunch of fun, and if anything, and I'll probably bring this up later, this feels like when we first started the game with Kamoshida's Palace. Kamoshida's Palace will be so impactful and always will be so impactful compared to the others because of how much it affected all of our main characters that we were just meeting 
and this feels like the same way compared to the others where it's like it was mostly affecting the character that was being brought onto the team. This definitely feels more impactful and it had the time to work its way up. It wasn't trying to rush through it so that we can just jump into another palace. Well, we were jumping into this palace, absolutely, but I mean, going through it. I don't know how else to explain it, but I liked how it's been taking its time, very similar to how the prologue did, and using how much we've learned through the game as a continuation instead of just a brand new start. I think this palace could be one of the best in the game for how much it took its time to work its way up. But I don't know. Hope you enjoyed my rambling there. Hope you enjoyed these two episodes of this session. If you did, make sure to leave a like, subscribe, all that fancy jazz, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take it easy.